When you're using a dual piezo input, whether it's a mesh drum pad or a stereo acoustic trigger, one of the first controls you'll want to take a look at is the rim shot range. The control is broken up into three sections. There's the yellow section, which represents the head of the pad. There's the dark gray section, which represents the rim or the side stick. And the green section, which represents the rim shot. Now I can adjust the size of these areas by clicking and dragging, or I can use the mouse wheel for nice fine adjustments. Whenever we adjust this control, what we're trying to do is make that green rectangle as wide and deep as possible. So to start, what we'll do is hit all over the surface of the pad and look for places where that white indicator is falling into the rim shot area. All right, so it looks like I have to make it a little bit bigger. All right, let's try that. All right, that looks pretty good. And now we'll do the same thing by hitting the rim. Again, we'll hit all over the rim and look for places where that white indicator is falling into the rim shot section. All right, that looks pretty good. Now that our green section is as wide and deep as possible, we should have no trouble at all triggering rim shots.